today's top stories and Power of Five weather from News 5. Hi there, everyone. Power of Five meteorologist Brian Shaw here. For the early and middle part of the afternoon, we are expecting showers and storms. They're going to move from the west to the east across northeast Ohio. We'll top off in the upper 70s to low 80s, but then drop later on this afternoon. By 6 o'clock, temperatures will be cooler mid to low 70s, but partly cloudy skies. So if you're heading to the Cavaliers watch party for tonight or just downtown, should be nice and comfortable for you. Upper 60s to low 70s, partly cloudy skies will eventually fall into the upper 50s to low 60s for the overnight. All right, Brian, thank you. Well, Nick Foley here along with Mona Kozar Abdi. Here's your top stories. It was a close call at Edgewater Park after three people are rescued from a sinking sailboat. The U.S. Coast Guard says the boat had drifted toward the break wall and was taking on water. One person was pulled from the water and the other two were told to jump in the water where they would be rescued as well. And just a horrible story, now a seven-year-old boy dead after an ATV accident in Ashtabula County. Ohio troopers say that the child was on the ATV with 18-year-old Ronald Atwater III when it went off the road into a ditch and struck a metal cul culvert. Uh, that seven-year-old was rushed to the hospital but later died. Atwater was airlifted to a Youngstown hospital. He's expected to survive. And it is game two of the NBA Finals. The Cavs play the Warriors at Oakland. The wine and gold is looking to even the series after losing to the Warriors in game one. And you can watch the game only here on News 5. Our coverage starts at 6 p.m. Tip-off is at 8, followed by our post-game show. Well, that's it for now. And for the latest news and weather, be sure to go to News5Cleveland.com or you can open up our News 5 app.